Good morning, everyone. So I'm making another vanilla morning shake. I'm going to add this small banana flavor added to the, it's called the banana flavor boost and it's going to be mixed in with my vanilla uh, mixture so that's what you see in the bag when you get it it smells really good it smells like vanilla and oatmeal basically and just to do a little bit more in-depth um, description of like what's in it so you guys can see kind of just showed the camera pretty quickly last time but here's some of the ingredients so I'm going to zoom in a little bit. There we go. As you can see, oats, pea protein, flaxseed, brown rice, protein, sunflower oil, gum powder, coconut, potassium, phosphate, some other different ones hard to pronounce going on down the line. But... And then you got the nutrition facts over here. So two scoops per serving. I kind of went over that last time, but just to kind of show you what's in it. You have two grams of saturated fat, 12 grams of total fat. You got the cholesterol, zero. Sodium, 291 milligrams. And then you got total carbohydrates, 42 grams. Dietary fibers, nine grams. Total sugars, one grams, and then one gram of sugar added. And then you got 29 grams of protein. So it's not just a protein shake because it does also have all those other nutrients. And it's like a food supplement. So you don't have to actually have food with it. So you can just take this alone. And here's the list. Sorry about the lighting. Um, here's the list of the different vitamins that are included. I'm not going to go all the way through each one of these because I'm trying to speed up the rest of the video but here's the bottom ones here you can see you get zinc selenium copper magnesium chromium uh, chlorine and choline so <clears throat> anyways we're gonna get to mixing uh, I got the shaker already cleaned up already put my first scoop in so I'm gonna show you guys how I do the second scoop so we just take a little bit, already mixed everything in the whole bag, and then you see that it's overfilled, so you just scrape it against the top of the bag, like this, or the side of the bag, I mean, to get the mixture down to kind of like a good level, like that. And then after that, you're going to get a little bit of powder on your hands and probably on the counter, but you just clean up afterwards. Then you add the scoop. Nice and slow, little clump in there, and then just kind of shake the rest of the powder off right here, and then make sure there's no water on it, and then toss it back in, and then seal up the bag, and then you're ready to go and start mixing. 